Okay, guys, so I know I have not been on here in a long time. Uh, I think my last video was probably in maybe um, the end of 2013, which 2013, I was like in July of 2013, I was in a really, really bad accident. So I haven't made videos like I would have liked to. So that's why I've been going. I'm not going to really go into detail about that because I'll do a separate video on my other channel explaining um, a little bit more because I think some things that I've went through in the process of um, going through that accident, it probably will help other people get through what maybe they went through going getting into an accident and a really, really bad accident at that. So, um yeah, but that's why I've been going, and I know a lot of people have been writing me, asking me how I've been doing. <laughs> I know they're like, where has this girl been at? She's been making all these videos, and then all of a sudden she just disappeared. So, yeah, um, but I really don't want to make this a sad video, so I'm going to jump right into what I'm here for. So, as you can see, I've been making, I'm going to try to turn it so it's a little bit wider. Um, but as you can see, I've been making, um, I've been collecting these crystals and stuff. And I have way more than this, but I'm just going to show you some of them. So, you can see the amazing sparkle on these crystals. And the difference of the crystals that I have, usually people get the flat back crystals, which I get also. But I like the point back crystals because they just have more of a sparkle. And I think it's because of the shape of it. Uh, so yeah, um, but these are some, and these here are, I think it's called John Quill. It's like a canary yellow, and then these are the, <coughs> excuse me, the black diamonds, and then these here are the, uh, is that Paradox? I think so, and then this one here is, um, a light amethyst and these kind of have like a rose gold backing on there the rose gold foil back and they are the point back as well but I got these from an estate sale um, and it's like over 7,000 of them and I think they're like a SS10 and these are different sizes you get um, like 10 grams um, for like um, forget how much they are but I'll post them below or you can just inbox me ask me how much whatever you want to know how much it was and where I got it from then you can just write me and then these are the aquamarines and I think these are in like a SS uh, 12 okay so then these are the crystal ones I mean the crystal clear and I have them in different sizes like a SS 40 SS 35 SS 30 and then I think this is a SS30 as well. And then I have like a SS23. Then it goes into a SS15. Um, I think the smallest that I have is a SS15. And then I have some um, SS10s, I believe, and SS7.5s, which are really, really tiny. But I do like the really, really tiny ones. So if I have like like if I'm strawsing out like an earring or a pair of shoes and you have like a tiny little crack that you want to fill that you don't want to show any of the shoe or the, the earring or something, you can stick those SS7.5s in there. So um, these here are some hoops that I made and it's just um, made out of the crystal clear um, crystals and it has pink pearls as well and this was just like a regular hoop and I just kind of used the pearls to put on here and I embedded the crystals inside the pearls in between the pearls so I believe I have like a SS23 some what is that SS15s and I believe some smaller ones yeah, I know SS28, SS23, and then some SS15s. So it's three different sizes on here. And then this one I didn't do all the way, but I kind of made it look like a like a ring because I put the bigger ones in the center. But those came out pretty dope. And then these here are some that I'm doing now. And these are just some big, gigantic ball um, studs. And I'm just going to stress them out uh, with the pearls 
I don't know if you can see it's really tiny it's as 7.5 crystals and then you have the black diamond that canary yellow is that jonquil color color and then a pear dot okay so some other things that I've done been doing is these little compact mirrors and they just kind of open up and close I don't want to blind you so I'm not going to really open it up all the way so what I did was purchase the bowl separate and I just used the E6000 to glue it in the center and I kind of wanted to mimic like the if you know the Tiffany's um, Tiffany and Company the jewelry box that they put the jewelry in where it's like the um, that um, whatever it's like that Tiffany blue color and then you have like the, the um, bow on it that's what I kind of want to mimic. So this is like an inspiration off of that jewelry box. And these came out absolutely beautiful. I love it. So all I got to do is finish the back of this. Okay. So then um, these I did. This is the front of it. I wanted to do some smaller hoops because I know when I used to make jewelry, a lot of people used to write me and ask me about smaller earrings. So I'm just trousing out these and then I have like a big crystal here in the center. And this has the light topaz, you have the crystal clear crystals, and then pearls. And then you have a really big pink crystal, like a, a diamond cut crystal here. And then this is how the back of it is going to look. So those are super cute. And you can get these in different sizes if you want. Then I have these here. Which are the light topaz. Then you have the um, ivory color pearls. Then you have the uh, aquamarine point back crystals. And it's just stressed out. And it's on a gold hoop. And then these are some that I'm working on now. And it's just like the flat back. These are actually made out of glass. And the aquamarine crystals are on the sides. But these square pieces, I, they're kind of like diamond shape. And that's the design I came up with. And then on both sides, you just have the crystals going up and down earring and these are actually clip-on hoops you can get the regular hoops that you can get the clip-on hoops like this you can get it on these type of hoops you can get it on bamboo hoops whatever you request and then these I picked up today I actually want some big hoops for my birthday and I kind of want to just put crystals all throughout the whole hoop because I want a real cute funky like little short pixie cut um for my birthday i'm gonna make a wig uh for the day and then i'm gonna make something super sexy and long for when i go out <laughs> at night so but these i want to wear with the shortcut so the thing about these they have these nice little holes in them cuts into the earrings and since i'm going to be using the point back crystal i'm just going to cover the earring and um, with the E6000 and I'm going to embed the point back crystals in these holes all around the hoop and they have holes on each side so I'm going to put them on this side this side and then it's going to be some down the center so they're going to be super blingy and then I have another pair that I picked up and I'm going to do a giveaway on that one and these here are just some hot fix crystals that I just got in um, I think these are like a, I don't know, I think a SS12. And then I have like a SS, I think this is like a 9. And then um, these I got today, but these I got from a different seller, and I absolutely love the sparkle on these. But I got the hot fix ones because I want to do a, um, I'm going to get a snapback hat, Atlanta hat, and I want to do the A sign and the crystals. So, yeah, that's why I got those. Because um, normally I don't use the hot fix crystals. 
but these I just have random stuff in like pearls the little diamond shaped pieces that I was telling you about uh, my hands are ashy too y'all because I can't really put lotion and stuff on there when I'm dealing with these crystals because I don't want it to smear into the crystals and then these I got from a seller on eBay and these are super super pretty but they were expensive <laughs> so yeah some black ones these are different color greens the crystal clear these are pinks purples um, like a peachy color this is different ones these are different blue aquamarine um, sapphire and then I have some yellow and I think like what's that like a orange color so yeah I have some more of these coming because I actually ordered quite a bit of those from different sellers so yeah but um the place that I get these ones here particular from is one of my favorite sellers I actually went back and I'm waiting on um three more orders from them because um, they have a lot of stuff that they auction off as, as opposed to like buy now prices. They have a lot of stuff that's buy now, which I usually buy. And then they have stuff that auction off that you can kind of win for a little bit cheaper um, because the crystals can be kind of high. So um, I have to, of course, wait for the bids to end and then, you know, I'll pay for some stuff and then I'll, while I'm waiting on other stuff to end. <laughs> and then so I wind up with a whole bunch of different orders but I have a lot of stuff coming so hopefully that stuff will be here this week and I can come back and do another video if you like this video please let me know and I will be sure to make more also I'm going to try to put out some videos just showing you how to make certain pieces um, so if that's something you think you might want to see definitely leave a comment below and I will get those videos up for you and I do have some other videos that I need to upload but I'm going to try to space them out um, so I can keep can giving you stuff to watch okay so talk to you guys soon miss you guys and thanks for all the people who have subscribed to me while I've been gone because I have been getting emails or people have been subscribing I try to subscribe back um, once I see the email if I'm not doing anything and um Thanks also for the people who haven't unsubscribed since I haven't been making videos, okay? Because I've still been watching you videos online. I just really haven't had time to make videos um, because I've just been going through a lot and I've been super busy. Um, so, as always, thanks for watching. You all have a blessed night. i got to go watch my show, my empire. Um, comment below and let me know how you guys like that show, okay? Talk to you soon.